it or not, NASCAR drivers are all humid, just like you and me. And 2016 has been a difficult year for a lot of people, from terror attacks to mass shootings and all the violence in between. Sports has been an escape from that hurt, if only for a few hours. Brad Keselowski knows he's an entertainer, but he also lives in the real world. You don't want to be, uh, you know, maybe the right term is unworldly and, and, you know, ignore what's going on. Of course, we all want to know what's going on. For Kevin Harvick, he knows how important his job as a driver can be when it comes to helping people heal. It's not uncommon to see, you know, pictures from mothers, fathers, grandparents, kids of, of their sisters, brothers, husbands, whatever uh, the situation is in the casket in your race gear. So, you know, at, at that particular point, you know, it, it's fairly obvious that you need to try to do the best you can to, to um, not take for granted what we do and, and realize exactly how much it means to a lot of people. Striking a balance can at times be hard for drivers, but they all understand their role as an athlete, role model, and entertainer. A lot of the attraction that our fans have uh, to this sport and any sport uh, is to, you know, help them get out of those moments or get out of that, that mental space. You know, it's definitely something that, that we can play a big role in, in being positive impacts on, on a lot of people's lives. And, you know, you get a you, it's a daily reminder. Of there was a moment of silence for the victims of the Dallas attack last weekend at Kentucky and again for the France attacks this weekend at New Hampshire.